go. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Let's Pray. No, wait. No, it's it's Let's Let's Pray. No, it, uh, it Let's Play Pray. <laughs> and and we're we are now in the uh, disturbing. Ah. Uh oh, disturbing music phase of things. Yeah, so, um... The, uh... Okay. Um... I... What are we... Mul what are the objectives we have? Access guts. The beams and waves lab. Uh, Alex's escape pod, neuromod division. Talus one exterior, seal the whole breach. Bellamy's room key from his body in psychotronics. Is he in Psychotronics somewhere? Where are we now? We're in Psychotronics. Yes, we're in Psychotronics. Is the light blue where we can see or where we've explored? I don't know. Huh. Hello. Let's check. I... I heard the mimic sound. Yeah. I can hear the weaver through the walls. Son of a bitch is gloating, I know it. How are you holding up? I dropped a couple of nightlights to lure the phantoms away. Put sticky notes on every goddamn thing I'm sure isn't a mimic. You? Good. Safe inside the armory. Squashed a mimic that slipped in, but that's it. I got everything sealed tight. What's our plan? Wait for rescue. <laughs> you know, if we make it, Alex is just going to pull our mods. You want to remember this shit? I think we could get out through the guts. Work our way up to the Arboretum. <sighs> okay. Say the word. Scanning target Typhon material inconclusive. Logging calibration request. Well, you're now inconclusive. In light of what we now know the Typhon are capable of, and not capable of. It seems prudent to revisit the Project Cobalt material. Igor, neuromods can already adapt Typhon material to the human mind. There's no reason in principle the reverse wouldn't work. Say so you managed to insert human neurons into a Typhon. How will you know it was successful? The new neural structures would need to mature over a series of actual experiences. Or simulated ones. What? Simulate the experiences. Calvino, he has... Right, okay, look, it's fascinating, but let's focus on what we know is working. Mm -hmm. I don't want anyone devoting resources to this. Oh. Oh, that... oh gee, they, they were, um... They, they wanted to insert memories into mimic material. Gee. I wonder if that will be relevant later. Yeah. And it was Morgan's idea. No. 
emits a burst of signals which suppress the psionic can be thrown. Oh, so you could stop that guy from creating clones of himself. Hmm. Lab notes, okay. May I explain how Mimics arrived here and how at least one survived in the vacuum inside the... Kletka? Kletka. That's that... So long. The Soviet vessel that was the initial point of all this issue. Hmm. If I remember... So they can... Yeah. Sorry. Sorry, if I remember right anyway. Right, and they shift they shift dimensions as a form of hiding so that they can jump out and eat you great that's yep. not terrifying at all V01065-37 has shown signs of further instability in the last day. Subject demonstrated morbid curiosity in small objects, attempting to place them in his mouth and consume them. Nutritive and non-nutritive. Yeah. Initial rapid answer, Pika. There was no evidence of this prior to exposure to the telepath. We're not ruling out suicide attempts. Subject isn't making an effort to hide it. Ah. Sorry. No worries. He's performing an endoscopic exam next shift to make sure nothing is lodged in the esophagus or intestine. Pika's, Joy. Pika's the urge to swallow inorganic, you know, non-food items, right? I think so. Um. Yeah, I think Pika's what happens when you don't chew. It's like, I associate the word with people who want to eat clay or stuff like that. Hmm. Anyway. Okay, I'm going to skip the, uh... Yeah. not read out about the, the Suicide Watch stuff. Yeah. Oh, joy. Okay. Hmm. All horrible all around. Well, yeah, I mean, we're in a... A horror game. <sighs> hey. Hey, you. Did it say attitude adjustment? Yes. Yes, it did. Um, that's not disturbing at all. Oh, night, okay. That's what they meant by night lights. Oh, wow, okay. Someone got an up-close picture of one of them. Yeah, probably seconds before they died. Yeah, very like. Sorry, there were two cups, and yeah, we can't have that. Mm -hmm. I'm I'm actually low key surprised that one of those neuromods wasn't a mimic. <laughs> oh, they wouldn't be that cruel, would they? I'm totally joking. They would absolutely be that cruel. I mean, they're. It could probably happen just by random happenstance if a mimic happened to decide to psycholuminescence. Oh, that's uh, that'll hurt me, won't it? Oh, I don't think it hurts you. I think it's just a bad sign. Mm. 
Isn't it fascinating? There's something almost angelic about those golden filaments like frozen light. The typhon wave it out of the thin air. The question is why? We have a lot of theories, but no solid answers. Not yet. I wish you were with me, Morgan. Not the way you are now. The way you used to be. I know we could tackle this together. Like old times. What the hell? Oh. oh. Uh. <laughs> That that's 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 not communication. That's just happenstance. So they are a intelligent. B. They. Oh boy. Not more spell spectro spectroscopy. Yeah. Hyperfine splitting. splitting of an isotope embedded in the large object. In this case, a Transtar coffee mug. <laughs> the creatures seem to have a weird affinity for them. Uh... If this was in the lab notes, why didn't you start doing other anything other than the coffee mug? <laughs> oh, transmutation. Okay. Hallucinogenic field, no. Well, pres discredited, debated hypotheses. Yeah, no, they're they're transforming, transmutating, literally configures its atoms and molecules. <sighs> Pocket dimension mimic swaps places with the object by parallel dimension. No. No. I think it's no, I the transmutation with putting extra mass in a spate pocket dimension. It's kind of a yeah. combination of, of B and C. Inventory overflow? Okay. You might I have a know. stack for the tor the Typhon organ, though. But uh... Oh, yes. I do. And the test tube. Okay. This music is really... It's pretty, uh... After the last six months here, I'm going with magic. Oh. Uh. <laughs> Pilgrimage to the Autarchy of the Domed? Yeah, that's a. Uh... Let me. Is it a video game or a movie? Probably a video game, considering its caves are all handcrafted. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. Gus lends at her. What if I told you you worked with us for a week? The week before the entire science staff had last caused neuromods removed. Left his badge in the locker. It... I had IT look up his account being deleted, but all his credentials, all but his credentials, who the hell was he? I'm guessing he died. That, that's a very safe guess, Thre. Yeah. I, I have to admit, I wouldn't mind asking Anne about what sort of protocols she'd be looking at for, um... This is the room, by the way. Yeah. Yeah, everything that's not a mimic. Some of it will be mimics, won't it? 
I honestly can't remember. I just remembered freaking out coming into this room. Uh, uh, uh. Wait. No, I want one of them to disguise themselves as post-it note. Um. We do know there's one around here somewhere. Oh yeah. was right here like this was where ah. I got attacked yeah is it the post-it note that's on the table in the back corner there because I think it disappeared around that table no Oh, don't we have a piece of gear that lets us detect mimics? Uh. I thought we had an additive to make this detect hit it yet. It's a sound aptitude available. Right. I have got four. Mm -hmm. I think the, that four there lets you modify guns more. Mm. Uh, that one is for soup mods. More inventory space. Ooh, inventory space is good. Yeah. I like the notes about natural lifespan, as if that's a thing that's going to apply in this game. Okay. Oh, there were two of them. You were saying something about Anne and what kind of protocol she would do for, I guess, this entire situation? Yeah. Be an interesting question. All right, so that's, that's the full circle. Now, we did see a phantom wandering around in this direction somewhere. It, the life bar showed up on the screen and we heard it talking yeah now how do we get into here
Well, Phantom taken care of. Just as you said something too, like yeah, we've been down there. Yeah, I don't know if we got up to the thing hanging. Did we get on the the structure hanging in the middle? I know we tried to. We tried to, but um, I I didn't get up there. Right. Um, like I think. I think this might be a, um, I don't think this is actually a clue. Hmm. It, it's an optional, like, collect the body type thing. I, I think it's meant to, like, bring your attention to the body, but uh -huh. you're not jumping over that unless you, I mean, maybe if you have more conditioning. Possibly, because I know there is an achievement for for identifying all the bodies. So there now, has that, to be a way to get up there. That looks like a hatch. It does. So how do we get up there? not this way you know the phantoms remind me of that movie phantoms a while back with the like weird sentient goo that can imitate the stuff that it devours mm. well that's great Obstruction detected. Please clear aperture of debris. <laughs> Sometimes brute force is the answer. Yes. Anti-red farmer fabrication plan. That seems like it's important. Requesting new operator. Transtar Pyramid 490 Medical Class Operator ready to deploy. Please stand clear of aperture. Diagnosing. Looks like you've had a rough day. This won't take long. Don't forget to complete a patient questionnaire. Your feedback will be invaluable. Scanning target errors. Insufficient target material found. Standing down. Um. What? Some this might be a good device? time. This might be a good time to switch uh, videos. Yeah. Also, let me do a save. Yeah.